four brushes in to using Castile soap to clean makeup brushes for the first time. I just knew it was something that you guys had to see. Hi everyone, Felina here. I wanted to share this fabulous find with you. I was really surprised to actually find it at Superstore. So this bottle was, I think, about 15 bucks, 18 bucks. Um, and I actually thought that having such a small bottle wasn't going to be useful. Um, but I decided to try it out. Now I cleaned these four brushes um, faster than I have cleaned any makeup brush in my life before. Now I've used Cinema Secrets, I've used other brush cleaners, um, but my favorite is actually glycerin soaps. It does have some glycerin in it as well, but it has a whole bunch of different kinds of oils and interesting things in it. It smells amazing. It comes, this one's lavender. So Senegin's products, um, because they're smudge proof, you know, they are a little harder to get out of makeup brushes. It's a little harder to wash them with soap and water. Um, it does come out eventually, but it does take a little bit more legwork. Uh, but this, oh, this is miraculous. So I literally put like just a few drops in the bottom of this little dish. It's just a makeup brush cleaning bowl. And I'm going to add just a little bit of water in there swished it around. Now this is my foundation brush. So after a few weeks of using it, like there is foundation all up in there. It is a dirty, dirty brush. Watch this. And look at how clean it is after just that. That's insane. That's absolutely insane. Give it a rinse with some warm water. Uh, I'm going to dip it again, but that is insanely clean for how little I just did. I'm going to take, this is probably my dirtiest brush, so it's pretty dirty, and I'm going to whoosh it around in here. Look at that, instantly. Usually... I have to really work the soap into the bristles to even get it to move. Look at that. That is so amazing. Now I'm going to rinse it. I'm going to do it again. Um, but look at how, how clean that is already. And that was absolute, like just seconds. And now, just rinsing with water, if I squeeze it, it is running clear. There is nothing else in that brush. And to touch it and feel it, it is, like, dry. There's no residue. Now, when I tried, like, a coconut oil and Dawn dish soap um, concoction, I had to wash them with glycerin soap at least three times following that because they felt greasy and disgusting. Now, here's another... Um, brush. So with Senegin's products, our products are smudge proof and generally waterproof. And so it makes sense that it would take some doing to actually get this stuff out of the brush. I am thoroughly amazed at how easy this is. Like this is absolutely insane. So Dr. Bronner's Pure Castile Soap. Look it up find it. Let me, I got to share this experience with you. Uh, let me know how it goes if you try it for yourself.